Tonight, it's a story you'll see first here on Fox 5. You're getting a first-hand look at some of the amazing, amazing artifacts that are being recovered from a revolutionary war-era ship. Now, it was discovered in Alexandria, Virginia. Archaeologists have viewed the ship up close, and they've uncovered all sorts of historic relics. And Fox 5's Tom Fitzgerald is in Old Town. He's had a front seat for all of this and has more. Hey, Tom. Hey, good evening. This has been incredible. You know, archaeologists tonight are calling this Alexandria ship a gold mine. Look at this. It's a pendant they found in the planks. It is more than 200 years old. It is just one of the many artifacts they have been pulling out of this ship for days now as archaeologists try to piece together the mystery of how this ship from the Revolutionary War is now giving up its secrets here in 2016. On Alexandria, Virginia's waterfront, archaeologist John Mullen is making history. I'm amazed that uh, the story of finding this particular ship has gone international. This Revolutionary War era ship was found in a hotel construction site. It is 50 feet long, 200 years old, and the subject of a million questions. You tell the story of the history of the uh, founding of Alexandria. Workers from Wetland Thunderbird Archaeology are slowly sifting and brushing every inch of this vessel. We've removed all of the timber uh, frames uh, piece by piece carefully. Our camera even captured one worker as he dug out a colonial era pipe completely intact. That's a rare thing. We usually find things broken up into, into lots of pieces. We find pipe stems all the time, but finding an intact one is... It's pretty unique. But well, you know, finding this ship was only the start. Experts will tell you what they found inside has been an archaeological treasure trove. Next to the ship, a warehouse and an outhouse were found with even more artifacts. So what are you finding? We are finding a lot of shoes, and this is the, the soles of the shoes. Teacup fragments, and this is probably could be a fragment from a chamber pot. Turns out these very small pieces of coral are very big clues about where the ship sailed. What does finding coral tell you? Well, uh, it tells us that the ship, and that's where this came from, uh, probably sailed down to the Caribbean. In fact, after 200 years, the ship will be heading back to water, a preservation tank as John and his crew continue their journey to study it. This is great. This is what we all do this for. <laughs> finding stuff like this ship. It's been amazing to watch all of this. Archaeologists will be back here on the scene in Alexandria tomorrow to commit a 3D laser scan of the entire bulkhead. Now, this is going to take a little bit longer than they expected. They are finding so many artifacts that they are really having to slow down their pace a bit. But, you know, ship's been here for 200 years, so uh, it can wait a few more days. We're live in Alexandria tonight. Lauren Sarah will send it back into you. It just keeps getting cooler. Just yeah. keeps getting better. Can't wait to see what else they find. Yeah, yeah.